There's one right there. Look at that. Just come around. Got a little deeper here. Just came off the edge, dumped a little line, and caught a fish. You know, hooked him up anyway. Let's see if we can get him caught. I'll tell you, one of the things that I think really helps me when I'm trolling is fishing lures that allow me to fish various depths. So what I'm saying is, I'm fishing up on top of this structure that I'm on. This is a gravel bar. Rocks, gravel, kind of a mix. But every now and then I come off an edge, I go into a little depression in it. And one of the things about the lure I'm using here is it dives deep enough and gives me the ability to get it down quick to just let out some line when I come off an edge because you gotta realize so often walleyes are an edge feeder. They're right on that deep edge, right off of where it gets shallow. Boy, did this fish eat this wally diver. Holy smokes, wait till you see this. I mean, he just buried this thing. He engulfed this whole lure. You know a fish wants a lure when he does this. Look at that. I don't gotta worry about getting hooked, I'll tell you that. It's all the way down his throat. Settle down there, buddy. But what's really cool about the bait that I'm using in this Wally Diver is it gives you a deep enough dive to be able to do what I just did. I'm fishing it up high, but then, this is gonna end up a keeper today. I'm also able to fish it in such a way that this fish, I can get down to them. And that's what I did here. I was able to get down to that walleye by just letting out some line. And because of this bait being what it is, having that extra dive, I was able to get down to them. So I'm running this bait with about 90 feet of line out, and I'm running right where I want to be, right up above that, that bottom in that 10 feet. And then as soon as I come off that ledge, then I just drop some line. So that's one of the cool things about fishing a bait like this. A lot of times people think, well, I'm only fishing 10 feet of water. I want to fish a bait that's only going to dive 10 feet at the most because that's where I'm going to be with the bait. But realistically, when I go off that edge, I want to be fishing a bait that's going to dive 12 to 14 so that when I do come off that edge, I can do what I did to catch that fish. Just let out some line, get down there to them. All of a sudden, that bait just kept going down that ledge. And that walleye was sitting right on the ledge and snapped that wally diver. It's a pretty cool deal right there. That's why you want to fish a bait that you can get further down than the zone in which you're really fishing so that you can go up and down that ledge. If you do that, you're going to catch a heck of a lot more fish. We're going to get spun right back up here and we'll do that same routine because that's catching a lot of fish, getting up and then coming down off it and letting out line. 